you the other day made a comment about 9-11 in which you suggested that the U.S. government had not been wholly forthcoming about what happened that day, that there had been lying uh, by the federal bureaucracies. That seems obviously true. Um, the response was unbelievable. It was immediate. You were attacked as a conspiracy monger, as a lunatic, but not just by the left, also by the goons at the Wall Street Journal editorial page, wrote a whole piece about how you disqualified yourself by even asking that question. What were you saying and why was the reaction as fierce as it was, do you think? It was fascinating, Tucker. It was, I've had many of these moments in the campaign where they said, this is the campaign ender. This is over. He just blew it. This is one of them. So, so this is like the, the fourth or fifth of those. But, but what was interesting about it was, right, this was not a left-wing chorus, right? This was mostly actually a right-leaning chorus. I and mean, Mike Pence, and he was deeply disappointed. Chris Murphy, this Democratic Center guy, says something very similar to Mike yes. Pence. And so it's fascinating. It says there's something going on here. So in fairness, Tucker, I didn't suggest it. I explicitly said that the government absolutely lied to us. Yeah. The 9-11 Commission lied. The FBI lied. Now, am I, is this a core point of my campaign? No, it's not. I actually went on a comedy show where some guy asked me, was the moon landing fake? I said, I think it was real. Then he asked me, did the government tell us the truth about 9-11? I said, no, they did not. So, so in response to a question, I'm going to answer honestly. Yeah. And the thing I had in mind was the facts. 